For proper operation, the drive shaft collars and steel plates must be aligned. Temporarily install the left side drive shaft collar on the 36 inch keyed shaft. Align the keyway slot on the shaft with the keyway slot on the drive shaft collar. Tighten the set screws to lock the collar in the correct position. the steel plate up to the drive shaft collar. Turn the drive shaft collar until the four holes line up with the steel plate holes. Install the right side drive shaft collar. Temporarily install 5 16 inch bolts into the four holes and tighten them. Make sure the keyway slot is aligned with the shaft keyway slot. For any bolt that will not go into the hole due to an offset hole alignment, drill the hole again while the collar is locked into position. Follow the same procedure for the left side. When the steel plates and drive shaft collars are bolted together with the keyway slots aligned on both sides, the alignment is complete. Disassemble the drive shaft collars and steel plates. Important, identify the top of the steel plate with a label. Repeat the same procedure for the right side.
Remove the painter's tape. Align the steel plate and drive shaft collar in the center of the wheel. Install the 36 inch keyed shaft into the drive shaft collar, steel plate, and wheel. Make sure the keyway on the shaft lines up with the keyway on the drive shaft collar. After aligning, tighten the set screws to lock the drive shaft collar in place. Drill four 5 16 inch holes through the spokes. Install a 5 16 inch stainless steel bolt and washer through the collar, steel plate, and spokes. Remove the 36 inch keyed shaft. Drill the quarter inch holes and install the four bolts through the steel plate and spokes.
stand the wheel up on the floor. Use a hammer and make sure the bolts are through the spokes. Install a washer and nut on all bolts. Tighten all bolts securely. The steel plate and drive shaft collar installation is complete. Repeat the same instructions for the second wheel. Be sure to watch part 4. I will show you how to build and install the center hub key. Thanks for watching.